now for the latest instalment in our series, My Best Shot, where the world's leading players tell us about their finest swing. This time it's Sandy Lyle, and you may be surprised to hear he hasn't gone for that bunker shot at Augusta in 1988 on his way to winning the Masters. Instead, Sandy's opted for a shot he played when he won his first major three years earlier. I feel the best shot of my career, which is probably not known as much, would be at Sandwich there for the Open Championship 1985. And it was the second shot, a uh, third shot, sorry, to the par 5 14th. And I'd already laid up short of the burn because I was in the rough. And that was on one iron with a strong crosswind, uh, probably about 20 mile an hour crosswind. Oh, come on, please. leave it. As soon as it came off the face and the line it took off on and the way I hit it, I thought, well, that's about as good as I could hit right now and, uh, and just be look at the guards and how I finish. It was about 50 feet away, but I actually made birdie from it. So that was the starting point of the turnaround um, for the Open Championship for me because I looked like I was going to face a bogey and I came off the green uh, with a birdie. It answers a lot of questions, your, your inner voices, when you, you're not sure if that situation arises, if, if how you're going to handle it. You might just totally melt and hit a lot of bad shots, or you might come through and think, well, oh, actually, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was. And I think if you have those sort of little sessions where things come off and your swing holds up well, it's, uh, it's character building and it also gives a lot of confidence. Winner of the tournament and the champion of the year with a score of 282, Sandy Lyle. Yeah.